Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to disable what some find to be an annoying ding sound when you're trying to change or adjust the volume on your Windows computer. So this actually came out of personal experience that when I went to go adjust my sound on my computer, every time you go and click around inside this bar, you hear a little ding. And this could definitely be annoying, especially if you have your speakers turned on and you hear a ding every time. So this tutorial will hopefully show you guys how to address that. So this is actually connected to the default beeping sound in Windows. So we're going to have to set our default beep sound to none for this. And honestly, I haven't noticed any real personal sacrifices for doing this on my own experience. So you're not going to really miss hearing any specific dings. At least I haven't heard any. So and you're always welcome to turn it back on as well so I'm just going to show you guys how we're going to do it and we'll start by opening up the start menu just by left clicking on the start button one time we're going to type in sounds one of the best managers I should come back with a sound right above control panel just want to left click on that this tutorial will apply for as it appears for earlier versions of Windows going back to probably Vista so should apply for most versions and once you're on here you want to go left click on the sounds tab now you want to go down and locate the default beep right here so just left click on that one time now you want to left click underneath sounds down here so you want to just select none from this list so you just want to go up to the top of the list here and select none and then once it says none just left click on apply and OK keep in mind that if you ever want to go back to your previous sound scheme you just go inside the drop down here and just select Windows default so you're not harming anything and I'm just going to left click on OK again to close out of there restart your computer and hopefully this has addressed your issue so as always thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial do hope I was able to help you out and as always thanks for watching and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial goodbye